All right, it's frosty cold outside. I found ice on the water outside today. So it's really nice and comforting to be drinking a cup of hot vanilla milk and honey. Oh yeah, that'll warm the cockles of your heart. This is really uh, just an absolutely comfort drink. It's not a comfort food, it's a comfort drink. And actually, a friend of our family's used to always make just milk and honey before going to bed every night. That was his routine. I've added some vanilla, and as an option, sometimes a little bit of nutmeg on top. It just makes a fantastic winter drink. It's so easy to make. Let's go in the kitchen and make some right now. To make our hot vanilla milk and honey, we only need a few ingredients. What we've got here is two cups of milk, one and a half tablespoons of honey. Like you could use something like a clover honey. I'm using an acacia honey today, very mild honey, but you could also use a stronger honey. It's just that it kind of might overpower you know, that, the vanilla flavor. So one and a half teaspoons of vanilla. We've got a small milk pan here. What we're going to do is just add the milk into it. And I'm going to turn that heat on right away so it can start warming up. Now remember with milk, we don't want the heat too hot, okay? Milk scalds quite easily, burns. So we just want to bring it up slowly. i got a medium-low heat going there. Now this is going to give us some time to get the honey out because it's uh, honey in winter. So it's a little stiffer. Let's get this out of there. All right, scoop that all out. Now, the nice thing about this is you don't need to measure this exactly like I am just, you know, I don't do this usually. I'm just doing this for now to demonstrate. But usually I would just take a, a big spoon, like a table spoon I use for eating, scoop some honey in there, and a little bit, uh, fill it up a little bit with vanilla, throw that in there, milk enough to fill a good mug. That's it. It doesn't have to be exact. Mmm. Now, acacia honey is really good. Now, using honey today and vanilla, but you could also use uh, something else like maple syrup. But as I use the maple syrup, I'd probably cut back on the vanilla and let that maple syrup flavor really take over. So many different kinds of drinks you can make with this. Now, let's add the vanilla. All right. I want to give that a little stir, but uh, I think that honey is still going to be quite hard. Oh, it's really dissolving a bit. Good. Okay, that's probably only going to take a minute or so. Just going to bring that up until, you know, the milk is good and hot. Not boiling. We just want it to get to the point where it's just before the boil. You just want to see the little bubbles start showing at the edges. So let's come back in a minute or so and see how that's doing. All right, that's just getting to the point where it's just little tiny bubbles starting to form at the edges. Uh, we can always do the dangerous finger test. Oh yeah, that's hot. <laughs> Alright, I don't advise doing that at home. Now, what we're going to do is pour it into a nice mug. Oh, look at that. Alright, see how easy it is. Mmm, and it's delicious. You know, you know what, I, you, another option is put a little tiny pinch of nutmeg on top. It's also very good. All right, enjoy making some hot vanilla milk and honey. Now, if you go to the link appearing on the screen, you can get the free printable recipe for hot vanilla milk and honey on our website. So go print out the recipe, have fun making and drinking this warming, comfortable drink, and make cooking fun again with Kuma's Kitchen.